Hi guys, so Chloe Lynn wanted me to do the makeup uh, that I did in my straight hair video. I think that was the video. Um, and so here it is. I went ahead and filmed it for you. This is like really easy. It's what I do like for a daily basis. Um, obviously sometimes I do less. But yeah, I really like it. I think it's really good for like the summertime. Don't forget to set your makeup with a setting spray. Setting sprays are life during the summertime. And if you've never tried one, you need to get one. So, um, anyways, that has nothing to do with the video. I hope that you guys um, keep watching and you'll see my next video. Okay, so I've already done my eyebrows. I've got a video on how I do them. Um, I'm going to have an updated one because I used two different brow products now. And I don't know. I'm, I'm going to have an updated one, even though that other one wasn't too long ago. Um, so watch out for that. But I already have them done, and I've already highlighted my brow. I've also put a moisturizer on my skin. This is the one from Simple. It's called Ultra Light Gel Moisturizer. And I also put an under eye primer on, which I'll have all that in the bottom bar. So let's get started. So I actually have my hair done for you guys today. So I'm going to pin these bangs back so they don't get messed up. Okay, foundation. I am used the CoverGirl Outlast. It doesn't match me that well though, so I'm going to mix it. I did a few pumps, but it wasn't full pumps because I'm running out. I'm mixing it with this L'Oreal Trim Match. And then I'm just going to buff that out with my Beauty Blender. So I'm going to use this NYX Eyeshadow Trio. I've had this for like four years. Almost four years, which is crazy. And I stopped using it for a long time. It's probably expired. But the eyeshadows still work the exact same, so I like it. Um, so I'm going to use Aloha, and I'm just going to tap it right here underneath my brow. This kind of has, oops, wrong color. This one has more of a satin finish to it, so it's not like super shimmery everywhere. I'm using this little All About Shadow Duo from... Clinique, and I'm going to take this taupey color here with my MAC 217. Now, I actually used a gel eyeliner when I was doing that, but this gel eyeliner is just getting like, too difficult to work with. So, I'm going to use a liquid eyeliner. This is Lash Food. It's a brown color, but it uh, dries more of a dark, like black, so. Of course, you know, you can do like some thicker eyeliner if you want to, but I'm showing you exactly how I had it in that video. First, this is from Jordana. And it's an eyeshadow pencil in Continuous Almond. And I'm just going to put it on our waterline. So now I'm going to set all of our face makeup with this e.l.f. Um, powder. And I'm going to bronze up my face with Sunny Bronzer. Just right at the tops. Of my cheekbones. On the sides of my nose a little bit. Then I use this same, or uh, yeah, the same palette, but this blush. At Aloha shade in here as my face highlight. Okay. 
Um, I've been using a lot of mascara lately just because, you know, it's getting to the end of the school year, or is, it is the end of the school year, and um, this is kind of my lazy stage. So I really don't, like, focus on one thing particularly but lashes because lashes are really quick and easy for me to do. So I just curl them. Then I'm going to use Falsies from Maybelline. I'm going to use Lash Ink Mascara from Hard Candy. It's um, supposed to be a lash stain. Um... I'm going to use this one. This is um, Nude Delight from Rimmel. Then this is Star Looks Lip Gloss in Cuddle. Okay, so that's the end of my video. Make sure to click here if you want to see my um, spring makeup tutorial. So, I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!